Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new safe hour. We are jumping in again <clears throat> and I, once again I've made the egregious mistake of starting to record a video directly after having just eaten. I don't know why I keep doing this. Anyways, uh, we're going to try and go as... Um, it's been a little while since we did Tainted Lost, but I'm feeling something a little more regular. Uh, let's try and do Tainted Blue Baby. It's been a little while since we've uh, given him a fair shot, and I feel like Tainted Blue Baby is one of my problem children. Um, I, by the way, I do realise we haven't done uh, Champions in a little while. I will get back to doing Champions eventually. Um, I've not completely written them off or anything like that, so do not fret. Do not fret. I will, uh, I will bring them back, but... At the minute, I'm trying to sort of focus on just getting completion marks. And some of the characters, the champion versions, aren't the best for actually going for completion marks. Now, I think I'm just going to take Celestial Crown here. Um, I'm not exactly sure how how best to do this. Okay. Okay, this wasn't so bad. Now we got to wait. Okay, thank God. That, that was kind of tricky, but we got there. Also, look at the amount of bombs we have right now. Well, holy hell, we have a lot of bombs coming up. But we just got Celestial Crown. Absolutely love this item. It's basically like fruitcake with extra steps, which I really don't mind. I'm just going to use a bomb here because uh, we've got so many of them available. So many bombs. Yeah, it's literally just fruitcake with extra steps. Now, the fire ones are going to be problematic, I'm sure. But uh, I like this. I think it's a really, really good, uh, really, really good item. It's a lot of fun. Synergizes quite well with various different things as well. Uh, I would very much like to find a secret room here, if plausible. I will hold one of these bombs as well. Some bugger tears going on in there. Some slowing tears. Also, it's it's kind of like if you fire through the um, celestial crown bits, it's a guarantee of a status effect. So it's, it's sometimes even better than uh, than fruit cake. Because you can get some guaranteed of specific types. Obviously, they are in reference to the colour. Uh, they do match the colour. So sometimes it won't always be what you want. But we can try our best. Good stuff. Either way, how has everybody been on this finest of fine days? That was really bad. I tried my best to not get hit there. But it did not happen. We'll see if we can maybe go for a, um, a soul heart in the shop eventually. We'll see. Bit of charm there wasn't bad. That fire's really well placed. Managed to get a lot done with that one fire. Okay, go straight for the boss, I think. And then we'll keep on heading on. Oh, but yeah, um, the other day, um, me and my girlfriend made... Oh, that was amazing. Me and my girlfriend made uh, chili. Uh, like, it wasn't really chili. We, basically, we made like a low-calorie chili and chips. And it was it was very, very good. It was it was quite excellent. Um, and uh, I, I just had the leftover, like, chili beef meat. Um... On a sandwich with some uh, cream cheese. Oh, some good stuff, man. Some good stuff. Right, uh, where are we thinking for secret room? Because there's a few different places it could be. I really don't like these. I was saying it, I think it was the last episode, actually. How much I dislike these goddamn L-shaped rooms for uh, trying to find secret rooms. I wasn't there, unfortunately. Um, okay, unfortunately, I don't really want to use my other bomb trying to find this, so... I guess we'll just go. In terms of what we're doing here, we probably want to go for Mega Satan and Light Path uh, is, is something that'd be good. We've already done Hush and Bosch Rush, so we've got no time constraints right now, which is pretty nice. I don't even know why I shot that. That was stupid. Um, we've got no time constraints, which is rather nice. I think we'll just keep on going. Getting Constellation, um, Const Constellation? Constellation Prize was a, a pretty good grab there as well. Extra bit of fire rate, which is... Something this character desperately needs, I think. Oh god damn, that was a, a fat old hit right there. We'll try and use our poops to the best of our abilities here, because I tend to I tend to kind of not use them enough, so I'm, I'm gonna try and use them as much as I can here. That was some really bad damage there. Some of these enemies I forget, yeah, I forget the way that they work, and I'm I'm getting hit by them a lot for no good reason. I am gonna blow this up and see what it does. They gave me some damage for the room. Not really what I was hoping for. I was hoping for HP, but there you go. Oh my lord. Okay, this might be a, a quick restart here, because, uh, I don't know, this this character is just my absolute kryptonite. I don't know what it is about him, but I just can't seem to do well as this character, no matter how hard I try. Regardless of if I get good items, I just play really, really poorly. 
Like, I get hit through some really dumb stuff whenever I'm playing as this guy. I don't know what it is about it. Is anyone else like that? Just find Tainted Blue Baby a really, really hard character for some reason, even though it makes little to no sense why it would be any harder. We got Corpse Flower here. I'll take it. Not bad, not bad. A token there. We'll leave the token for now because I would like to uh, double grab a soul heart if plausible. In fact, so much so that I will go in here. And unfortunately, we did not get a soul heart. Uh, I don't know what this is. I, I'm, I'm fairly sure certain that's a black lantern, but hey her. I guess I could um, I could duplicate my, my glass D6 if my boss item isn't any good. Okay, these jumping jack boys obviously got to go. Keep it going. Again, use this fire to our advantage here. Oh, you flew right into that. Right as the fire expired, though. That was kind of rude. Oh, for I keep forgetting these guys can fire spectral shots. It's really throwing me off, man. Oh, my lord. Almost died there. I mean, we could still easily die here. Yeah, there you go. I told you, this, this, this dude... Just something about him. Something about him. That was a pretty good run as well, that. Oh. No, I'm not getting hit in the first goddamn room to a stupid fly. Fun item, though, here. I like this. It does lower our damage a bit, but it's only to make up for um, the damage that we gain from it, so not terribly bad. But yeah, I just need to be better earlier on. Whoa. Whoa. A 10 cent damage, please? How does that even work? I'm unsure, but I want to find out. I would very much like to find out. That is not what I meant to do at all, and you know it, game. Come on, game. Don't do this to me. It's not going to let me get that 10 cent Damocles, is it? You know it's not. You know it's not going to let me for some reason. It would be super sad, but such is life sometimes. Such is life. Have I done a question of the day this episode? I don't think I have, have I? <clears throat> What's something that's cheap that you, that like, you really value that it's cheap that they haven't caught on to the fact that it probably should be more expensive than it is? Okay, we are only one penny off now, so that's not too bad. Stunning effect is nice here too. Good, good. One more penny. And then we can do a Damocles run, which is, of course, a bad idea, but also fun. Especially bad as a character I get hit as so regularly. We're just waiting on that single penny. I'm pretty sure you can damage me if I don't get rid of him. Oh, hello. It's kind of intriguing. I don't think we'll get enough bombs to... Uh, Make this work, but it's intriguing nonetheless. Good, good. use the fire star, damn it. Come on, Penny, where art thou? Don't be like this to me, game. Don't 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 shaft me with the one penny off. Let's try and blow this up and see if we can get a penny out of it. Hey, there you go. Lovely. Right. <clears throat> Quickly go and check out this room as well. Ooh, pretty good room. Burn heart, please. Ayo. We in the money. It's only really worth half a half a heart, but whatever. Right, I want to see how this works. I'm gonna I'm gonna go pop Damocles and see uh see exactly how a 10 cent Damocles is gonna work for us. How spooky. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Just gives you Damocles for 10 cent. I'll definitely take that on the first floor. It's dangerous as all shit. Um, and it'll probably be the thing that ends our run, but... I'm just gonna go for it and see what's what. Oh shit. What? Very confusing room there. Not really sure what the deal is with that. But we did just get a glass D6, which I quite like. We'll leave that there for now. Lovely stuff. 
I was about to say don't get hit for as long as I can, but I know that that's just going to mean I get hit straight away, right? We all know that, to be the truth. Ooh, what the hell kind of attack was that? Yep, there you go. Got hit literally straight away, so everything's fucked now. <laughs> Damocles is, uh, is looming already. That was uh, extremely quick to be hit there. I wish Damocles, like, once you'd been hit, it, like, made it bloody or something so that you knew. But yeah, pretty, pretty tragic there for us. Pretty tragic. I'm trying to create a line here in case any of them decide to pop up there. It also means we can use this as a sort of platform to get some extra stats. Can you die already, dude? Kind of taking the mick a little bit here. Oh my god, this guy. There you go. We got him eventually. Yeah, a little bit sad about how that went down. I was really hoping to go as long as I could without getting hit here. Um, size up and fire rate. Yeah, I guess I'll take that. Don't know how big of a size up it's going to be, but oh, that's not too bad, actually. And it's a pretty good fire rate increase as well, so happy days for us right now. Happy days for us. I mean, we were bound to get hit early on anyways. I just... Kind of wish it wouldn't have been literally the very first floor. Nah, fine for that, thank you. But yeah, Botfly goes with our technology-based stuff we got going on right here, so I'll take him. I kind of hope I get hit really early on this floor, just to make me not feel as bad about getting hit last floor. There you go. There you go. It happened. Now I don't have to feel so bad. Now I don't have to feel so bad. Okay, be careful with this big bastard. Yeah. Toss a few bombs over there. We got him, we got him. That's good stuff. That's good stuff. We'll take it all. Right, let's keep going. We, we, we've just got to be speedy here. We've just got to try and absolutely zoom. I mean, I still think there's a very low chance that this works out, but... There's still a chance. Also, I need to save a bomb for uh, uh, our angels at some point. Let's try and remember to do that and not use it on something stupid. <clears throat> there you go, some extra bombs. I apologize if you can hear my emails ticking away. They shouldn't be... My notifications should be off right now and they're not. I'm sorry. Good, good. Some extra pennies here. Not bad, not bad. But yeah, getting mapping would be really good so we don't go wrong ways and we don't have to. But that's a pipe dream, honestly. I ain't, I ain't gam um, letting it all ride on that because that's just not going to happen. Uh, I will try this out, to be fair. There you go. Just a key. Nothing really that great there. Ooh, you do triple shot. Hello. That's intriguing. Okay, we don't know what we're getting here, unfortunately, which isn't great. Hey, more more robot stuff. Unfortunately, items there not entirely great. Um, these are worth it. I'm gonna say yeah, it was. In fact, teleport out, and we can make our way back down that way and not have to actually fight the room. The extra danger of fighting that room is not not what I want to see. Lovely. Let's see what those I extra items end up being. Oh, God. It's a pretty rough room here, this. There is, however, a tinted rock there that I'd love to be able to uh, grab if uh, these guys would play ball. There you go. Uh, really? Just a bunch of extra poops. Thank you. 
Okay. Careful now. And let's see what we actually got from here then. So, item wise, toy box. Not bad, not bad. We even got a revive in there. Unfortunately, this did just start up the combat again, which I wasn't expecting. And we also got the friendly monster as well, which is kind of meh. Right, ah, oh, bad hit. We got this blowhole item thing, which is not bad, though. Really, I really hate when you blow one of them up and it's like, here's one penny. <laughs> How mean do you have to be to give me a single penny? Anyways, keep it going. Try and see if there's a soul heart in here. There isn't. I didn't think there was. I didn't remember there being one, but... Oh, you had to just do it, didn't you? But yeah, we got a lot more spiked rocks from uh, the whetstone that we uh, smelted, so that's going to be maybe problematic. You really had to land there as well, didn't you? Yeah, it's going to be maybe problematic. Well, I guess we'll see. Give me that back, thank you. I love that regening heart thing. It's very nice. Ooh, we got a mega chest in here. I mean, we don't quite have enough keys to make that viable, I don't think. I'm not going to bother with it right now. Right, just take out these guys. Don't know how I'm not dead yet. <laughs> or not hit on this fight, at least, should I say. Oh, I love that. Um, two more random items. Hearse on Hearse is good. Supper's fine. Okay. Down we go. You watch Damocles be an absolute bitch and, like, hit me, like, right on the last fight. Or it's gonna, like, do it super, super early. I, ha I have had Damocles fall in, like, seconds before. <laughs> nah, not quite seconds, but I've had it be, like, minutes. Good stuff there. Yeah, okay, having all these spike rocks is not actually... It's dangerous for us, but it's not actually that bad of a thing, really. Because, um, as you can see, many enemies are going to end up walking into them. Lots of extra HP coming our way at the moment as well. I like that. I like that a lot. And an extra key, thank you. Right, item room. Can we actually see the items this time? We, we can't. We got Curse of Blight. So yet again, we're blind to our items. You can see the outline there. Um, I know that's good, right? Crossed heart. Damage up, you feel healthier. Picking up a red heart's 50% chance. Okay, it's not actually that good. And this is a book. We don't have an active right now, so I guess I'll take it. Oh, it's Book of Jubilees. Okay, I'm actually pretty happy with Book of Jubilees overall. Right, keep this moving. Yeah, not 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 a bad selection of items there. The cross heart I did think was something soul heart related, which is why I was more excited about it. Unfortunately, it is not, but it is still a damage up, so it's not terrible. Uh, there is a soul heart available here. Lovely. There's also. What, whatever this is. Everlasting pill. Oh, we've had this before. This thing's kind of crazy. Or can be. Um It's a bit it's a bit of a janky one, to be honest. It can kind of screw you over. It can telepills you and stuff. Not much more else to see on this floor though. Oh, th these are the these are the eyes that can shoot us, yeah. Kind of place this in a pretty bad spot, to be honest. And I've just x laxed myself as well. That's uh, exactly what I wanted. Lovely. Okay, we got him. And we got this, which is good. This is um, the coin, like the coins. But honestly, I'm kind of okay for pageant boy because I want to keep my d6 for something like an angel deal. Anyways, uh, down we go. I'm, like I said, I'm trying to speed along as quickly as I can here. I think it's the only way 
we're going to keep this run alive for any more than a few minutes. <laughs> but we're, damage wise and stuff, we're doing okay. Okay. A bit of a rough room here. Rooms with a lot of rocks are always going to be a bit rough. I don't know what epidemolysis does. Is that less iframes? I think it is. I'm drowsy is one of the good ones that we can get. Especially on bosses. Just got to be obviously aware, like I said, of the telepills. Where's we got a holy mantle from somewhere? No idea where from. Uh, I guess we'll take Perkiga. Why not? And then in here we've got this, which is good. I guess I'll take this. It's not great. I just don't want to use my D6 on um, on anything other than an angel deal, really. Oh, there you go. The spiked rocks absolutely killing it for us there. Oh, wait, what? Um, I don't know what just happened, but Damocles fell and we didn't die. Hold up. I think I just made the most accidentally genius player of my entire Isaac career. I think what just happened is I just popped the everlasting pill, got feels like I'm walking on sunshine at the exact time Damocles fell and saved my own life. That is one of the luckiest things that has ever happened to me in this entire game. Because, yeah, I, like, I, I was like, oh, hold up a minute, but I, I'm fairly sure, I don't, I don't remember fully, so that might not be what happened, but I'm fairly sure I heard the I feel like I'm walking on sunshine line played when I used my pill, and Damocles fell. So we, we, we just got a bunch of extra items from Damocles with no downside, essentially. Um, we no longer have to rush, but I'm still going to zoom down this floor anyways. That's that's literally the single luckiest thing that has ever happened to me in this game, I'm pretty sure. That is absolutely outstanding. It's, it's, it's a little sad that it didn't happen just after the um after the uh, angel deal, so we've got an extra angel deal item, but I I'll I'll let that one go. That is like, unfathomable how, how lucky it was. Like I said, it's so lucky that I barely even recognized what happened. I just saw the Damocles on the floor and was like, hold up, why is that there? My god. Like, just, the, like, someone has to go and work out the odds of that happening. Like, how, like, how many non-stat affecting pill effects is there? There's probably like 20, maybe not 20, it's probably like 10 or 15, right? And then getting that effect and then using it then. But then also, if you like, I don't know if anyone actually knows how to do this, but then if you could calculate in the odds since we started of Damocles falling, that it would fall at that exact time. My god. Insurmountable. That's insane. I I actually, I'm, I'm so dumbfounded by how... How crazy that was. That This run would have been literally over right there and then. Literally done, sir. But we got so insanely lucky. Because it's like... The thing is, it's like... I've seen people get lucky before where they've had like a book of shadows. And they've um, they've popped it and, and Damocles has fallen right if they popped it. That's lucky. But... You're in control there. I, I didn't even plan to be invincible. Like, I, I wasn't planning for that at all. I was literally just trying to get an I'm drowsy proc. That's all I was doing. I was just hoping for the goddamn best. Um... What's corruption do? Teleports me to the error room. Okay, uh, I think I'm gonna re-roll these to be honest. 
Flechette's real good for us right now. Makes all of our wisps stronger. We've got one permanent wisp, if you remember correctly. Molding Clay. I'm sorry to say it, Everlasting, what's it called, but Molding Clay is just too good. And I guess I'll buy the battery just in case. Right. Good stuff. My god, this, this run is insane. <laughs> But yeah, we've now got Flechette, which makes our uh, Wisps a lot stronger and deal more damage. And we've got the Everlasting Wisp that never dies. Like, when, basically when it dies, it just respawns as another Wisp. Very good stuff to have alongside each other. We've seen Item Room, we've seen Shop. Well, I think we're good to go here. Um... Unfortunately, that went very, very quickly. Trying my best here to kill quick, but it's not easy. I hope we get another angel deal here, but I'm not betting on it, really. We didn't take our full card, unfortunately. I should have done that first. Um, we're going light path here. Compound Fracture. Um, I could take Compound Fracture and then um, Libra. Would Libra actually be a good take here? I do have fairly high range. I do have decent shot speed. I do have decent speeds. I think it would be. So I think we're going to mold and clear for that. And then grab Libra. Which, yeah, overall is a damage up and... Wait a minute. Let's just quick... There you go. Um, overall, that's positive for us. That, that's given us... Um, a bonus to our fire rate and our damage for a sacrifice to our speed and slight bit of range. Libra's a good item, honestly. If you've got the right stats for it, it's really good. I realize this is a bit of a waste of time, but them items were too good not to take together. I, I mean, I love Compound Fracture. Compound Fracture is one of my favorite items, generally. But um, on top of that, having this, rather nice. That's a shame that creep doesn't last longer. I'm hoping we do get the second angel deal to do Mega Certain, but you never know. We could always do Delirium, though, if that's not the case, I guess. We'll see. Alright, don't you bother. Unfortunately, with Compound Fracture, the problem is going to be that it's so easy for us to accidentally destroy our poops. That didn't really go where I wanted it to. I'm trying to just throw out all my bombs here. I want as many, uh, as many of the creep ones as I can. That can do some big damage for us. Oop, one second, I'm getting a phone call. One moment. Right, we are back. I apologize. Many a things have, have been going on. Many a things. I've been gone a little while, but here we are. Anyways. This uh this this little water fountain uh thing here is a little laggy. <laughs> oh, also we got this guy doing his thing. I really this boss can shoot his fire and do what he wants, but I'm not having it. Like, just the fire. Just, it spews for far too long, and, like, the distance on it is crazy. Stop! Just stop! <laughs> okay, good, we got him. My god, it took a little while of doing, but we got him. <sighs> yeah, it's a little sad to not have doubled items for the rest of the run, but considering we got saved from Damocles by, like, literally the luckiest thing that's ever happened to me, I think I can hack it. I think I'm okay. Damn it, no more poop slick. We're not getting much poop slick at all here. Which is a shame. I'm trying to, like, filter through as many poops as I can to get it, but... It's not happening right now. 
Let's be sort of more on it. We're trying to kill the actual bosses. Lovely stuff. You're in the way, big fella. There you go. Got a bit more going on there as well. I think I can push that towards him. Ah, oh, not quite, not quite. I do like the fact that the room is just covered in these little pet, like poop pickups. I can just use them all the time. A triple guy there. Ooh, a spiked rock. Are you, are you taking damage to that spiked rock? Yes, you are. Lovely. Oh, does the bat... Is the bat taking creep damage here? It is. Nice. Wouldn't have expected that. And so are you, good sir. So are you. Oh, my God. I'm taking some bad hits here, but I think it's mostly okay. I think it's mostly okay. There you go. Larger patch there. This is great. This is actually a really good character for this. I never sort of thought about how good this guy would be for Bosch Rush, and he's very good. Unfortunately, some of the bosses are still a bit of a nuisance. I'll try and keep this poop alive, but we'll see. Yeah, unfortunately, burn fragments are flipping around everywhere, and they're going to end up hitting this poop pretty quickly. Especially if this guy gets literally right on top of me. Why would you do that? Oh, my range just about reaches these guys. It's kind of nice. Good, good, good. Okay, that kind of worked out. And these lasers are, like, hitting enemies that are further away from us as well. Little tech module, whatever it's called. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, dude. One burn, he just went rogue there. Bloody miles away. Honestly, this guy's going to be kind of tricky. It's going to be a bit of a pain. Also, I do apologize. The frame rate's bad right now. I don't know if it's because of all the poop decals on the floor. It might be. Okay, that poop is gone now, unfortunately. Probably got two or three more waves. Oh, really? Two enemies that don't spawn on top of the creep? How dare you. Right, I've, I've, I've literally covered this entire patch now. Every time I get hit, it just lags the game even more. Maybe yeah, we, can, we can get fire mined by standing on this, which is kind of nice. Look at all the poops. There's a luck penny in there as well, apparently. My god, there's so much going on. There's so much going on. I don't think the black poop does anything for us, does it? Slowing creep, maybe? Oh, maybe that maybe it does provide slowing. Okay, as long as these guys are sat on the fire and the uh, the creep and everything, not a problem for us. That was kind of close one. My god, we got to be almost done. I, see, I don't remember how much of Bosch Rush you did before I left for the phone call, so <laughs> I don't know how much we've got left. Ooh, lovely little explosion there, wasn't expecting that. And I like the way that, like, the poop sort of effect, like the green poison here, lingers for a short while. Oh, I managed to blow myself up there. We lost a bit of HP there that we probably shouldn't have, but overall, I think that went reasonably well. I'm thinking when we, uh, yeah, when we exit that room, frame rate is, uh, is back to, uh, back to normality. Back to feeling good. Good, good. We're still unfortunately hoping to get our second key piece here. We've not got that yet. Now that we've got Libra between the rooms as well, our stats are much, much better. Which is always very, very nice. God damn. I'm hoping we're going the right way here. I don't know. I know that we don't need to be fast anymore. We've not really got a sort of quota for trying to get there quick anymore. But I still, I still like, when I'm on pace for a quick run, I just kind of keep that pace up. It's like even once I sort of rush for boss rush, I still end up rushing sort of the rest of the run. 
I don't know why my stats keep changing per room, by the way. Is that from a uh, defibrillator? Might be. Because uh, of Libra plus defib defibrillator. I think that's what it is. Ooh, thank you for that. It's lovely. And again, lovely. We've already fought you. Back off. Now, if I could not get hit by him constantly, that'd be great. I do kind of need some of this HP. That's nice. And... I guess I might as well do this and just get a boatload of pills. Why not? Tears down, of course. Speed up. We got a tears down there, which is an all stats down. Otherwise, that was okay. Slightly annoying, but okay. Right. Oh god, I always forget those guys shoot as well. Keep forgetting as well, we've got the Book of Jubilees doing some extra good stuff for us. Right, one last chance at an Angel deal here. 62% chance, but you know it's going to give me the Devil deal. It just always does. God, the, whatever we're, we've got that's doing Fear Shot right now is really an inconvenience. A major one. Like... Please. <laughs> oh, I forgot how healthy those king boys are. Right. Come on, game. Unfortunately, one wrong way thus far. We shan't have too many more, let's hope. So many more spiked rocks going on here. Trying to say too much more damage because we are we're not in a like really rough spot, but we are like on the cusp of it being bad. These enemies are unfortunately rather annoying. As are these guys, goddamn. If only we had charm. Charm on these guys is real good. Have them attack it all of their own with the herming. Lovely. Unfortunately, Book of Jubilees isn't really giving us what we want right now, but I'll take a burn heart wherever that came from. Is that another wrong way, unfortunately, there? I'm pretty sure that's another wrong way, isn't it? God damn it, game. It just knows the way to annoy me, doesn't it? Keep us box. I mean, I guess I could just use it, but I'm too annoyed about the wrong way thus far. That was a big wrong way as well. Don't do it to me again, game. I'm really like having Compound Fracture as well here. That's a lot of extra DPS we're putting out. That plus the tech item is there uh, is really pairing quite well together. Try and deal with these freaks. Oh, what the hell hit me then? I think he spawned a tear on me. Burnheart has gone. Really? despise. There's a mod, actually, that removes this curse, and I, I am very tempted to grab it, because there's n like, there's nothing I hate more. <laughs> Is that not it? How is the one of you left? Okay, this, this feels right. This feels right. Now, this is kind of horrible. I can't hit this goddamn tentacle. I, I literally can't get to it. Okay, there you go. We finally got to it. Get out of here. Good, good. Boss time. Good, good. I do have a bomb stocked away for if we do get an angel deal here. So I can use these bombs freely. On to the last phase. Mm. 
Rubber Baby's doing a good job with this. I like that. All right, cool. Angel deal, please. Hey, that's amazing. Good stuff. Um, and I, I guess we'll take this. Um, wait, no. I think, I think what I can do is I can do this. I can go grab that, and then I can dice shard it. Really? Okay. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. Okay, cool. Mega Satan is on the table now. We did take the Polaroid right, indeed we did. So, half the soul heart and up we go. Good stuff. We do have to kill our blue baby so we can't go straight to Mega Satan here. Hopefully not too many wrong ways this time either. Unfortunately, we probably won't get to use our... Uh, probably won't get to use our thingy here. Modeling clear. I don't really see where it would come into play. We'll try to if we can, I guess. The world. Oh, that is very, very nice. Okay, that, that helps a lot. That's going to save us a boatload of time. Does Book of Jubilee sometimes give us HP? I swear it does. I don't know what all the payouts are from Book of Jubilees. I know there's money. I know there's a holy mantle. I know there's a bed. Um, I know there's luck pennies, but I can't remember what else there is. Really, that hit me after I pressed the button. Thanks for that game. Trying my best here, but it's a little tricky. Okay, nice. We got him into second phase at least. Can't really do much with the uh, poop creep here. I've just got to hope for the best. That was a bad poop to just throw directly at him. I didn't realize it was a holy poop. My bad. We got him. Lovely. And we've got our keys available for opening our chests. That should be good to go. Then we just got to hope we can find Blue Baby quick enough. Bad. Okay. Uh, do we have anything we want to duplicate here? I don't think we do. We'll see if we get any other chests that we want to end up duplicating the items from. Yeah. Oh, God. This could be a bit of a nightmare. I just don't want to lose too much health before we do Mega Certain, to be honest. We should be okay, but oh, not when we're taking bad damage like that. That's some abysmal damage to take. But we got a black heart back out of it from uh, Serpent's Kiss, so that's kind of nice at least. Thing is, I can't actually use Serpent's Kiss anymore, though. Like, I used to be so good. I mean, I understand why it got nerfed. It was obscenely strong before. But it's a lot harder to actually get the black hearts out of it now as an item. Try and destroy these fires if we can as well. Unfortunately, we're out of bombs right now, so can't do that yet. Oh, there you go. So, uh, Buckle of Jubilees definitely just gave us a burn heart. That's nice, at least. That's something. Something to hold on to. I don't even know what's going on right now. This is so hectic. Oh, what? What? I managed to kill one of those guys without him blowing up, and it oh, and then he blew up on me. You bastard. We've got really tiny tears right now. What what's going on with the super tiny tears? Did I take a pill that did that or something? Don't have any items that do that, I don't think. Ooh, that was a nice room to get that on. Ooh, Degas. Rather nice for the extra HP, thank you. Unfortunately, no chests as of yet. <laughs> nice laser beam. 
That was very well timed. Seems like we're potentially going the right way to the boss, though. We're on a corridor that doesn't seem to be ending, so... I'm gonna, I'm gonna say I'm hurtful. God damn, though, another single chest is very unlucky. Hey, there you go. And I don't know if this will actually work giving us this twice, but I'm gonna try it. Nah, I don't think it does. Decent item, though. It's only once per room, so it's not gonna help too much on the bosses, but it's a bit of extra damage to start the fight, I guess. Hey, yeah, Book of Jubilees is definitely dropping us HP on occasion. This has to be the boss. We've gone so far, man. What's going on? What is out this eternal cage? Oh my god, how is it not over yet? Trying to get as many poops rotated as I can. I want a holy poop in the mix, but I doubt we'll get so lucky. Right. I'm right now fighting the sky. At least another soul heart there. I like that. I'll try and grab it whenever I can. I'm somehow not getting hit here, and I, I, I'll be honest, I really don't know how it's happening. I mean, I'm happy for it, but it's a little confusing. Burn Boy is the, is the one that I get hit by most, because that sort of jumping attack he does. It's not doing it at the moment, though, so that's good. I don't know how he managed to blast that bomb away, though. Hey, there you go, he's doing his jumping attack, but apparently him being feared makes it a lot harder for him to hit me. Still not over the, this phase yet. If I had normal bombs, I'd be in the money here, because I could just plant a bunch of bombs on him, but it's not really happening. Okay, there you go. I think iframes are carrying us through a lot of this as well. This, uh, this item that's making our tears like slow down in the air, I don't think is helping. I think we're about done. There you go. Good stuff. Okay, there's that done. And let's go and do Mega Satan. Mega Satan might be kind of a long fight is the only thing here. There's going to be a long trip back on its own. But yeah, I'm not quite sure how how well Mega Satan's going to go, just because I think it, we're going to be there a while. Should probably grab poops along the way. In we go. Yeah. Again, just do what we can. That that was a really good um, bomb poop though. Seems to do a good about good amount of damage already. I don't think there's much else we can do to help things go along. We've just got to hope for the best. We got an acid uh, thingy there. We got a power pill. That's kind of nice. Stay with me, good sir. Oh my god. And we got another pill in here. Like I said, we do get the invincibility, which is kind of nice. The tide is over. Oh man. So far, this has not gone really how I wanted it to. Having a kind of hard time killing these bosses. I thought these guys would be like the easy part and... Thus far, the fear is really throwing me off. I, I really don't mind fear that often. For some reason, on this run particularly, fear has just been an absolute bitch. We've got a second power pill in here. I don't know where all these pills are coming from, I'll be honest. Yeah, this slowing down tears thing is really ruining our range. Making it a lot harder to actually hit him.
Yeah. I had a feeling that uh, taking Power Pill here for the Black Hearts would be a good idea, and it very much was. <laughs> we managed to gain a hell of a lot of Black Hearts there. We've got two left over as well. I did take a few in excess that I shouldn't have taken. But I've been holding on to that just in case. Fortunately, the second one didn't work as well in this scenario here. And I think I just did just take another excess one by accident. So, okay, there's still plenty to go around. But yeah, like I said, it's going to be a long fight. Just trying to throw as much poop as I can at him. Okay, just... We're out of black hearts on the floor now. Onto the final set of spawns, the. Like, we're not killing stuff super slow or anything, but. The whole fight is just a bit slow going. I bet that Brimstone didn't really do exactly what I expected to do at all. Oh, that didn't kill you? I thought that bomb would have hit you. Right, I set up the creep here to try and utilize for extra damage, but still not in the greatest spot ever. At least the poops do block shots as well on occasion. Ow. I tried to set up the poops, so I ended up walking right into him. Damn. It's taking some time. Oh, just, I literally just sat there and took that one. Right on the noggin. Okay. If I could see my own character, please, rather than just this man's face, I could do what I've been planning to do this whole time. And fire off that over there. There you go. And get a fire mind on this entire spread. But look at that. The tears only just reach. But... Kind of working out actually. They're kind of lingering and then just exploding on him. You could move yourself over a little bit, good sir. Into the middle here where all my shots are. My explosions are bashing him away. Fuck's sake, move over. Managed to destroy one of that poops there as well. Let's try and grab some of these random poops that are chilling over here. This isn't ideal, but we've got enough HP to make this work still, I think. Have to say, I don't like a lot of these attacks he's doing, though. Unfortunately, I don't think any of the Fiend Folio poops have any effect on the, uh, the creep, which is a shame. Um, literally no idea what exploded on me then. Absolutely no idea. My god. We know we're going to win. This is just tedious at this point. Just let us win. Let us have the victory. Should have put my creep a bit closer. He's nearly there. Oh, we got a random half uh, soul heart out of that. Nice. I think I can just stand in his face now and I won't die with this invincibility and stuff. Take all my shots. Take this random knife that's in my butt. Is that hitting him? I think it is. There you go. Okay. Oh my god. Bit of a lengthy fight there, but we did it. I hope you guys did enjoy, and yeah, this is one of the luckiest runs I've ever had in my entire life. I could do Delirium as well, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna just end it there. I hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.